course, I had to start the new year with our lunch, of course, is from, where do you think? Uh, McDonald's. Wangs. Wangs? Wangs? But, not, it's, but it's spelled W-A-N-G, but it's Wong. You actually say it Wong. No! <laughs> <laughs> but if you say it Wong, then you're not saying it right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You know, Just... we have two... <laughs> You know, Kelly Wong worked for us during the holidays. Yes, I know. I know. <laughs> and Nicole Wong works yes, here as well. Yeah. It's her sister, yes. But I know. two Wongs don't make it right. <laughs> here it comes. <laughs> you know, this guy can entertain himself yeah, for hours. Funny. I mean, that's the stupidest joke ever, but it's really funny. As far as you know. As far as I know. Okay, this, again, you know, we just talked about this in the classic series, but this that oh. day that, that the Chilean family came and we sat and we broke bread and we tasted olive oil, we, they brought this and I freaked out over it. And I said, where have you been hiding mm. this stuff? Well, the same... I don't know why there's a pack, my, pack Same my. guy that I talked we talked about in the classic series that brought me a Malbec for Paul that I didn't even waste his time, it was so bad. Mm. Also brought a Carmen Air which was 50% wow. more than this wine, and I wouldn't even pour it down the drain for fear of what it might do to the, my pipes. Well, hey, wait a minute. Why don't you tell me? Because I got a clog in our drain. The oh, house. I well, I, I clogged up our drain, too, and that would have just made it worse. <laughs> Anyhow, this is, so this is the Vintner fun. Series 2014, the Wine of the Month Club, for those of you that don't know, including my co-host. Um, and I am at wow. Massiana, and who cares who else is here? Uh, so anyway, Kunzer Reserve Carmenere. Air. Carmen no, 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 no. Yes, 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 <laughs> yes. Uh, Carmen Air was once thought, as you well know, to be Merlot. That's right. In Bordeaux. In Bordeaux. You know, and that rhymes on purpose, by the way, <laughs> boys and girls. Let me, and, I, I want to say, I want to talk to some. Is this wine foreboding? Yeah, I'd say it was foreboding. Because you got some fan mail here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and this is from, uh. I'm going to just say, call him J.H. In, in Oklahoma. Oh, and, okay. Uh, he and I have spoken a few times. He's a very good customer. And uh, he says, I love the club and the great deals you value and value provide. Think the, I think the podcasts are a hoot, but you've got to stop saying the wine is foreboding. And I, I called him. And I said, I don't say that. It always says that. Right. And he goes, well, foreboding means a sense of something bad is about to happen. <laughs> well, so in other words, right before you show up here, it's very foreboding. <laughs> right, right. But like this wine, which is also foreboding, it bad doesn't happen. <laughs> so it's about to happen. You're not sure it's well, going to happen. Well, it kind of gives sense. you. It kind of gives He's you right. a little. It gives you a little tense. It makes J. you. J H, you're right. And um, even though he says it's a minor complaint, keep it the good work. And uh, I would like to add that when your people deal with me on the phone, they're absolutely great. Obviously, you didn't train them. No, I trained them. Right. Anyway, thank you, J.H., because you're right. And this is one is not foreboding. It's yes, the it opposite is. of foreboding it's because absolutely. something good's about to happen. Well, I know that, but that's why it's a play on words. You want to play? <laughs> Jeez. Okay. This wine is absolutely delicious. This is, this, is, this is really, really good Carmen Air. You should have tasted the other piece of crap that this guy wanted me to bring over. Well, I appreciate you saving me the headache because I've gotten plenty of headaches from the wines that we tasted together before. Not too many. I usually... Wow, this is really good. Oh, it's got a ton of I'm, character. Hey, it? what are we going to... First, it's $22.99. Reorder price is $11.99. That is correct. And secondly, I'm doing a 95 That price is foreboding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, They're Marlo. Boating. Marlo. You know, this is from, uh, you know, folks, we have lots of ways to buy wine here at Wine Month Club. We do it every way you can. We buy them from brokers, we buy them from agents, we buy them direct from the winery, we buy them direct from the winery in Europe, we buy them from uh, suppliers in Los, in, in Los Angeles. But this one, this guy came out of nowhere. He used to be an a, a immigration attorney. Oh. And, and, and now turned wine, wholesale wine guy. Is he nuts? Yeah. I mean, he went to school and he yeah. passed the bar and he started his practice and then he got out of it completely and, and got into wholesale wine. But he really stirs the pot. And I, this Marlo, we, we have the caviar today. I just think, oh, look at that nose. It's so great. And I don't, I'm not a big oaky guy. And this, there's enough oak in here to give it character. But yeah, but it's not in the mouth. You get a little bit of oak component in the nose, but you don't get that overbearing mm -hmm. toothpick. You know, you're right. In the mouth, you get really sweet uh, green apple uh, Chardonnay fruit, which I think is absolutely delicious. Wow, it's really good. It's delicious. And I've um, never even heard of this company before. Of course, me neither. That happens all the time, but but this is a family-owned thing. 
$24.99 on the shelf, $12.99 well, the river. price. Well, it's Russian River. I mean, you know, that's that's high rent district. You mm -hmm. know, that's 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 expensive real estate. Mm. I could, I could, this is really you know, good. I have a, a family. We love them. They're great friends. Every Christmas, we all our kids come back from wherever they're at. We have dinner with them, and she always brings a bottle of Rombauer Chardonnay. Always brings it. She won't drink anything else. She just, and I, I bet I can get her to drink this. One of the best selling Chardonnays in the world. Yeah, and it's, but I mean, it's fine. But I, I, mean, I have no comment. <laughs> but it's a chain item. Well, whatever. I you mean, know? you know, it's also in a lot I, of restaurants. I think I can get her to drink this. So interesting. Okay, I'm doing a 95 on this. I'm doing a 94 and a half. Four and a half. Three significant digits, as we call it in the business of mathematics. Four and a half. So here's our friends at Marlowe again. This is a California designation Cabernet, but it has so much more character. Yeah, than but you but uh, but a lot of the grapes came from one area, and I can't I can't remember where, offhand. Well, it must be Sonoma. I think. Um, Oh yeah, well it, it's it was it was bottled in, in Sonoma, but yeah, and so are the grapes from the other from the shard. Yeah, yeah, I think I think a lot of grapes did come from Sonoma on this wine. Now the nose on this wine is a little brighter than what the actual palate tastes like to me. A lot more complexity than what the nose suggests. Oh wow, this is an ager. You know, this got some this mm -hmm. got some sock to it, mm. but not socks. Make no, sure that, that would you understand be, the difference between that would be, uh, socks and sock. So okay. we were at. Um, the Strand House. You've been there yet? On the, a fabulous hey, restaurant. Really good. Fabulous food. restaurant in Hermosa Beach. And we were sitting at the bar stand, and I, I'm having uh, my usual gin, martini, and she's having a glass of wine. And um, the, the bartender and the mate, the sommelier, were opening a bottle of uh, Zin. I can't remember which one of the big brands. And they both made a face like this. <laughs> <laughs> Are we sure it was like that? And I go, corked? They go, yeah. They go, how'd you know? And I throw my card. I go, oh, well. So then they started bringing us stuff to taste. Yeah. He goes, you gotta taste this. You gotta taste this. You gotta taste this. Well, the sous chef there is a great kid that 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 studied under Robert Bell at Chez Melange, and when he was 17 years old, his parents he really wanted he had a passion for cooking, and his parents sent him to Italy for a year and a half, and he he toured Italy cooking in different places. Wow. When how he cool came back, he was telling Robert how to cook Italian food. That's really cool. And I'm telling you, it was the only time, and I've known Robert for. 35, 36 years, I never saw him or heard of him listening to anybody, yeah. especially some 19-year-old kid, you know. But that's a cool experience, though, right? But, oh, and I'll tell you, when he came back, God, could that kid cook. I mean, he was really that's, something. That's pretty neat. <laughs> and he's doing some great things at the Strand House. It's really a phenomenal yeah. restaurant, and it's a phenomenal-looking restaurant. I mean, it's visually well, the stunning. The TI was, like, really expensive. You know what I ordered? I went there twice in the week, and I ordered the to barbecue tofu. I don't know why. I don't either. It was excellent. <laughs> it was. I ate the whole thing. It was absolutely excellent. That would be foreboding for me. Yeah. <laughs> Marlo Cabernet Sauvignon, twenty six ninety nine on the shelf, eleven ninety nine. Yes, boys and girls, eleven ninety nine. Just at the Wine of the Month Club. Get yours today. Ninety six points. I gotta. I gotta revisit my business plan. Nice. Eleven ninety nine. Let me turn my phone off too. Okay. And last but least, the no! next. The, the next foreboding wine, Howes, Howes Creek, are these um, from the Deutschland? I couldn't agree with you more completely. <sighs> this is a Shannon Sauvignon blend. Oh, wow, and Shannon jumps out of there. Yeah, Shannon really jumps out at you. No wonder, wow. no wonder when I first tasted it thinking it was yeah. Sauvignon Blanc. I'm like, God, this doesn't taste like Sauvignon Blanc. Yeah, huh, shocker. So you were speaking about this kid that went to uh, Italy. Mm -hmm. um, the youngest leaves tomorrow. No, leaves Wednesday for Austria for a semester. And she's, wow, that's uh, exciting. Yeah, because actually University of Redlands has their own campus in Austria. Where? So it's like a great program, Salzburg. Wow. But the other one leaves uh, a half hour later to a little town outside of Leon to bake for five months. Isn't Must that cool? be nice. Isn't yeah. that cool? Yeah. So then the, the, she she practices, she bakes in the classroom for four months, and then uh, for one month they're required to go work in a bakery in, in town. Isn't that cool? So excited. Daddy, would you send me there too? Can she's I go? She's a great, well, actually, it's part of her whole college thing, so she's actually doing, she, I just give her a ton of credit for just doing it. She's going to be on a plan by herself. She had to go, we have to go to the restaurant depot and buy the baker's pants and right. shirt and everything, you know, because yeah. you, you have to have when you show up. Mm. Mm -hmm. Really nice wine. 
Napa Valley, Shannon, Sauvignon Blanc. I do like Napa for Shannon. I, I like, really do. Yeah, there, but we, we were talking earlier about Tulare County in the previous uh, classic series, and uh, the best Shannon in California comes from up there, Clarksburg. But, it is very good up there. But there's this, has a, ton, this has a ton of depth in it compared well, to... Well, because it's got the Sauvignon Blanc in there, too. And Sauvignon Blanc from Napa is phenomenal. That's, That's a great area for, for Sauvignon Blanc. So, I'm not sure where you'd find this because it's such an odd animal as far as uh, it's such a small winery and it's such an odd blend. But it's twenty two ninety nine when you can find it. You can get more for eleven nine, twelve ninety nine from Wine of the Month Club. I love the package. Nice and simple. Yeah, it's really simple. And I'm I'm doing a ninety three there. Yeah, I'm doing ninety four because I think it's really good. Mm, oh God. Well, that's our show for today, boys and girls. The um, the Wine of the Month Club Vintner Series for twenty fourteen. Two years past when the Earth should have been destroyed. What a foreboding.